Dr. Jesse Sanders. I am the owner and chief veterinarian of Aquatic Veterinary Services. Today we will be talking about water chemistry and how you really can't tell anything from your water if it looks clean. Really, the only way your water is going to be dirty if you have additional algae in your tank or pond or there's a lot of detritus floating around. But for the most part, just looking at your water, you can't tell if it's clean or not. In order to really know your water chemistry, you have to test regularly with a liquid-based test kit. I know everyone likes to use those strips, but unfortunately, they are terrible. They don't tell you trends. They don't tell you really any helpful information. So liquid-based test kit is the way to go. Now, we're going to do a little experiment. I'm a little worried about this. So we have two glasses of water here. One is from my tap, and the other is from my fish tank. So obviously, one is safe for me, and one is gonna be safe for my fish. But if you look at them, those look exactly the same. So I don't remember <laughs> which one is the fish water and which one is the regular water. Um, I'm going to guess that this one is the regular water just because it looks like I mean I they are both perfectly clear so we're gonna find out now if this is a good idea or not so again for your fish how do you know which one is safe and which one isn't so we're just gonna try this out <coughs> nope guess wrong um whoo that's that's not that that tastes very fishy <laughs> So obviously, just looking at these two glasses of water, again, one is safe for fish, the other isn't. And you can't tell by simply looking at your fish tank. Unfortunately, pH doesn't show up, ammonia doesn't show up. You really have to test your water regularly with a liquid-based test kit. Uh, in the links below, we actually have some recommendations if you want to go ahead and purchase a new one. Yes, they have expiration dates on them, are only good if you do not open the packaging. Once those little uh, vials have been opened, they are good for one year. That's it. You get about 100 tests out of them. So again, if you're doing once a week, just to kind of get yourself rolling, once your levels are all stable, you can switch back to every other week, once a month. If you have kids in middle school that need science fair project, these are great because you can make graphs out of the different values. So again, just because your water looks clean does not mean that it is safe for fish. So hopefully you learned something. I'm gonna go wash my mouth out. Uh, if you have any more questions about fish and fish health, please visit our website at cafishvet.com. At Aquatic Veterinary Services, fish are treated like family.